Before I was diagnosed, I was dancing full time with the Joffrey Concert Group. Um, we were dancing basically nine to five. Back in February of 2014, I noticed a lump in my left breast, and originally I just thought it was a muscle knot. It just hurt to do everything, but I still didn't tell anyone. I wanted to perform in New York and just keep dancing. By the last show, I couldn't move my arm, but I still performed. I had to perform. My breast cancer is spread to my lymph nodes and my bones, and it's terminal, so that means I'm incurable. I'm in treatment for the rest of my life. No one's immune, no one's too fit, no one's too young. Anyone can get breast cancer at any age. I've always hated my boobs. I was larger than a normal ballet dancer. So I always had to pin and make sure like I was secured and I was finally like, I can get rid of them. So I, I told him right away I wanted a double mastectomy. My relationship with my scars has kind of been a bumpy ride. While I have the body I've always wanted, I wasn't expecting to have these scars. About a week after I was diagnosed, I was starting to get really depressed. And the teacher who taught that class said, well, why don't you start a blog? It might be a good way for you to express yourself. So I was just like, what if I call myself like the bald ballerina or something? And it was like a light bulb. I started dancing when I was four. I was speech delayed, I'm dyslexic. So it was my way of expressing myself, even when I was little. I've done like a 180. I've become more confident and I talk more and I put my foot down more, I say no. And I've also learned to say what's on my mind. Because again, I don't know what tomorrow has in store for me. So I don't want to bottle up my emotions and not say what I really feel. The day after I was diagnosed, I was right back in the studio. I was dancing all through my chemo treatments and when I had my surgery, I, the first thing I asked was when can I get back in the studio? I've really learned to live in the moment and take advantage of everything that's coming my way.